Hey, it's John F. Gately. Welcome back to the show. There's new footage out from PBS of Dr. Fauci and Washington Mayor Muriel Bowser going door to door in June of 2021, trying to convince people to get the shot. And it's a revelation, I guess, on two points. One, to show how wrong Fauci was about so many things. And two, about how right so many average Americans were instinctively they were smarter than dr fauci in the summer of 2021 let's get into it so this is anacostia historic african-american neighborhood in new york they have neighborhoods here they have wards so this is ward eight uh, it's the typical social determinants of health where they don't get good medical care they have a high degree of hiv high degree of covid 19 and I, Dr. Fauci, am riding in my SUV paid for by the government to save the day. By the way, I'm also wearing a double mask, and so is everybody else in the car, even though the vaccine is 100% effective, and if you get the vaccine, you can't get the virus, and of course, you can't spread the virus if you have the vaccine either, right? Hi, Madam May. Nice to see you. A real pleasure. They're not wearing their masks. But of course, they're they're sophisticated people, aren't they? How you doing? I'm doing well. I'm good. All right, let's take a look. Oh my God, Dr. Fauci. So it's PBS. So obviously, paid for by your tax dollars in part. There's several scenes where people are really excited to see Dr. Fauci. Uh, Dr. Tony Fauci. Let's hear it for Dr. Fauci. Notice in the background, they're raffling off cars. Now, you can only get into the raffle if you get vaccinated. And this is going to come up later in the video. Thank you very much, Madam May. It's really a great pleasure to be here in this ward. I've been a resident of the district for 50 years. Yeah. Uh, so I'm... Of course, I'm Dr. Fauci, and I live in Northwest Washington, which is leafy and uh, wealthy. And this is Southeast Washington, which, uh, as Dr. Fauci, he wouldn't go there without a police escort, and especially he wouldn't go there after dark. I'd like to believe people listen to me, but some don't. <laughs> what are you going to do about those other states? Oh, my Just... God. They're going to keep the outbreak smoldering in the country. It's so crazy. I mean... Okay. They're not doing it because they say they don't want to do it. They're Republicans. They don't like to be told what to do. You Republicans, well, you've got to be broken. Yeah, yeah, we've got to teach you. And oh, by the way, Fauci does encounter a number of people who love Fauci in this neighborhood. But in a minute, he's going to encounter some people who aren't convinced. And I don't think they're Republicans either. No, no, not at all. In oh. fact, we got to get you vaccinated so that... If you were to get infected, you could pass it on to them. So you're actually protecting your family by getting them vaccinated. Well, I heard that it doesn't um, cure it and it doesn't um, stop you from getting it. Oh my God, this lady is off script. Call the minority port, call Tom Cruise. And oh my God, absolutely positively cancel all of her social media accounts. No, so on the very, very, very rare chance that you do get it, even if you're vaccinated. Lie. It's a very, you don't even feel sick. It's like you don't even know you got infected. It's very, very good at protecting you. Do you remember when breakthrough cases became the majority of cases and breakthrough deaths became the majority of deaths? I do. Just the Anacostia, so get up okay. there. Okay. All right, Thank see you, you later. Thank you. Have a good day. The people in America are not settled with the information that's been given to us right now so i'm not gonna do you see bowser's face she is not happy this guy better never call city hall for anything be lining up taking a shot on a vaccination for something that wasn't clear in the first place and then you all create a shot in miraculous time it takes years to but create vaccination Fauci, well it, it used to take years okay it used to, it, it you know used how to take you know how many years were invested in this in this approach about 20 years of science to get us to be 20 able to years do is it not enough and nine months is definitely not no. enough for nobody to be taking no vaccination that yeah. you all came up with 
just a couple of months after they made this video in June of 2021, the CDC actually changed the definition of what is a vaccine because people with the vaccine were still getting the virus and they were still spreading the virus. So what type of vaccine is that? The only yeah. reason I'm talking to you right now, well, as close as we are, is that I've been vaccinated. Right. But if it allow thousands of people like you don't get vaccinated, you're going to let this virus continue to percolate in this country and in this world. Something like the common flu then, right? You're going to kill grandma and it's your fault. And then the guy says something like the common flu. And, and not like, not it's like much more serious though. than the flu. Though. Well, the flu kills a lot of people annually yeah. too. You know how many people bad. died of the flu the last year? I mean, not this year, virtually none, but the previous year? Virtually none. How did that happen? It's almost as if they took the flu statistics and made them COVID. No, I, I don't want to say that. That's a conspiracy theory. About 20 to 30,000. You know how many people have died from COVID-19 in the United States? 600,000 Americans. Well, you, well, that, well the, the number that you all given that died, that, that once again, that's you all's number. You see, this guy instinctively knows, he doesn't have a whatever degree Fauci does, and neither do I for that matter, but he instinctively knows that the government is overcounting. They are counting deaths from COVID and deaths with COVID. So if you fell off a ladder and died and happened to get tested for COVID at the hospital for before you kicked the bucket, you were a COVID death. You gonna pass. Yeah, definitely. Because when, right. when you start talking about paying people to get vaccinated, when you start talking about incentivizing things to get people vaccinated, it's something else going on with that. Something yeah, else, something it, else going I, on with that. It is something going yeah. on with something it. Else You're right. But I'm glad millions of people like me and almost everybody here she admits it. There is something going on brought to you by Pfizer. And that's what brings me back to the whole raffle off of the cars and then de Blasio giving out McDonald's. It was all a scam to pump up the numbers because it's good for Pfizer. Didn't get an incentive. You know what their incentive was? Protecting their health and protecting the city. Well, but that, I, well, well, I won't keep doing it anymore. It's okay because my, 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 my incentive y'all campaign is about fear. It's about inciting fear in people. You all attack people with fear. That's what this pandemic is. It's a fear. It's fear, this pandemic. That's all it is. That guy was fantastic. They didn't want to listen to him. You see how they kept on walking down the sidewalk? They didn't want to listen to him. Remember, he didn't prepare that. He didn't know Fauci was coming to his door that day in June of 2021. He just knew instinctively if the government is at their door and they're willing to help him he knew that whoa uh this i'm here from the government i'm here to help you no no i don't think so and he instinctively knew that good for him and i bet you he'd be a fascinating interview if somebody from the media went out and interviewed him today almost two years later hey i'm john f gately here in america's hometown plymouth in massachusetts where i live amongst millions and millions of fauci worshipers in Massachusetts, behind enemy lines, have a great day.